to examine the ulnar nerve in the cubital tunnel, we again use the medial epicondyle and the olecranon as our bony landmarks. You will feel there is a groove between these two bony landmarks and you place the transducer across that groove in the transverse plane. We have the medial epicondyle on the left screen and the lecranon on the right screen. The ulnar nerve is hypoechoic. In this patient, we don't see the honeycomb appearance as well, but that is one of the ways to identify the ulnar nerve. So as I scan distal, you can see and appreciate how it has that honeycomb appearance. Now going back to the ulnar nerve, the entrance to the cubital tunnel is a structure called Osborne ligament. And you can see it extending on top of the ulnar nerve, and it is contiguous with the arcuate ligament, which bridges between the two heads of the flexicarpi ulnaris muscle.